Robert Ellis here. Apple TV 4K. What they did not tell you. <clears throat> so, here's my Apple 4K. Let me put it on uh, the main menu. I also want to get this other remote ready. Okay. I have a Sony OLED Apple TV 4K. I had it for a very long time. And this is something I was not aware of when I got it. But even if I was aware of it, I would have still bought my Apple TV 4K. Because I watch everything, everything through it, except for YouTube content. Hmm, interesting. Um, who has the largest, if you want to call it, library of 4K, 4K content? It's YouTube. It is YouTube. It's not Netflix. It's not Prime. It's not anybody else. It is YouTube has the largest 4K content. All right. Now, 4K content through Netflix, Prime, beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. All right. Stunning on my Sony. Stunning. Absolutely stunning. Okay. Let me show you something. All right. So. Let me go into YouTube here. Do, do, do. There we go. YouTube. YouTube. Yep, that's who's watching it. Okay. Shows you how often I don't use it. We're going to go to over to some of my stuff because I record everything that I do in 4K. All right. And we're going to go to a fairly benign clip. We're going to show this. Well, I won't show you the commercial. Skip the ad. And we'll take down the volume. We don't need to listen to me. All right? But here's what I want to show you. Looks good, doesn't it? However, let's go in and look at... Uh, let's go down and look at what kind of content we're getting here. You notice that it says HD. Only HD. And if we go back over down there again, come on. And we go over to the little bug, which is show you live stats, right? If you look there, it says the format is 4K. If you look up there, 38040 by 2160, right? Um, but it says current output resolution is 1920 by 1080. By 1080. Apple TV 4K will only display YouTube at the highest resolution of standard 1080. 1080. That's all you'll get. You won't get any higher resolution displayed out of the Apple TV. What's up with that, Apple? It's not like... Um, so Apple does not support... Does not support on the YouTube codex for displaying at least 4K. They won't, they haven't, and they won't do it. What's up with that? It's not like they would have to pay a licensing fee because the codec that they would have to use is open sourced. So what is Apple's bitch with YouTube and or Google? You know, it's like how moronic to sell an Apple TV 4K and not support YouTube in 4K. It's moronic. So I don't use the standard uh, YouTube app on the Apple TV to watch any 4K video from YouTube. What do I do? Um, I simply uh, use the native app that's on my Sony TV. It has uh, an Android TV thing on it, right? And I go and use... The YouTube application on that. Come on. All right. Let's go to uh, library. Let's go to videos. Let's pick up the same video. Okay. Now, 
Hmm, interesting. Um, let's go down and look at whoop 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 whoop. Let's go look at what the content is displayed at. And you notice the four in the little blue square. It says 4K. Yes, it's displayed in 4K. To even prove it further, let's um. Let's go to the bug so we can see what the resolution really is outputted at. And you'll look at uh, current optimal resolution is 3840 times 2160 at 30 frames a second. Um, there you go. Now above it says viewport frames. It says 1920 by 1080 times 2. Okay, times two. But this is outputting in 4K. Let's take off the bug. Da, 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 da. There we go. And let's get rid of that. So, in order for me to enjoy 4K content, I have to watch it through the YouTube app on my smart TV with Android uh, TV, uh, Android OS, whatever the hell is on this, Android TV OS, and watch it there. And that's where I watch all my YouTube content. Now here's another rub. You know, another rub. Oh yeah, rub. All right. So I have the latest version of the iMac, 27 inch, 5K unit sitting right in front of me the absolute latest version of it so it's got eight cores it's an i9 processor it's maxed out in megahertz has 40 uh gigabytes of ram bada 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 all that good stuff right so if i bring up safari which is apple's browser and go to youtube and watch a 4k video guess what it's displayed as the highest resolution yes you're right it's only displayed at a maximum of 1080, okay? Yes, HD. HD, that's the maximum you can get out of it. I have a 5K display, and Apple, you know, doesn't support YouTube at 4K. Moronic. Absolutely moronic. Now, if I use Chrome browser, my buddy Scott was over here the other week. So, hey, try the Chrome browser or something else. See what happens. And absolutely, when I run cr the Chrome browser, you know, Google's Chrome browser, um, I do get YouTube in 4K. In 4K. Yes, I do. So, what does that mean? In essence, it means Apple is being a dick. Okay? It's just being a dick. Come on, Apple. Wake up. Support YouTube 4K. Come on, wake up and do it. It would be really nice for us 4K, 4K content lovers to be able to see it natively through the Apple TV or on our freaking computer sold by you guys. All right. Now, seeing as how Chrome supports 4K, right? That means they could easily... I think easily, that being Apple, easily um, support the codex necessary with a firmware update. A firmware update. Or do it in some sort of software. It doesn't need to be done through hardware, obviously, because if I can see it through a browser, that's not hardware driven, right? Right? I guess, right? Huh? I'm not a friggin' hardware engineer, right? So I don't see why I can't get 4K coming through the Apple TV with the YouTube app on the Apple TV. Wake up, Apple. Get your proverbial butt in gear and start supporting the largest 4K content provider there is out there. Okay? Get your panties. Take them out of their knot. Okay, get together. Get, it's open source. Get it done. Don't be moronic about this any longer. Robert Ellis. Hmm. Hmm. Well, 
拜。